Welcome back to the Carquinas Bridge Toll Plaza Command Center for the CC80 PAVE Project. I'm Barton A, the Public Information Officer on this job. We're 15 minutes out from our update, but we wanted to give you a little, another little look behind the scenes at how we handle traffic operations for a big job like this. And I'm here with Amjad, who's going to tell us a little bit about what we do prior to a project like this and how we monitor it through construction. Thank you, Bart. On a larger construction like this, Planning for the traffic management begins well in the, in, the, uh, in the beginning of the design. It's refined over the period of design and it's finalized well before construction. Routes are selected, delays are calculations are, are completed, and that information is passed on to our public information office to inform the public well in advance of the upcoming closures and the detours and the delays. And as you can see, the, uh, the detours in this case that we are observing were selected at that time and they are functioning according to the plan. On the day of the closure, the traffic operation teams meets with the public information office and construction office and the command center to provide assistance by observing the traffic flow and the cameras that you can see here. And we monitor, our team monitors the traffic flow takes remedial action if there is an incident in form CHP to restore the fl uh, flow of traffic uh, to the normal to normal and at the same time in the field the um, traffic operations staff runs those detours and determines the actual delays and passes back on to the command center where they are communicated with the public information office to uh, pass it on to the to the public uh, the expected delays that are taking place at this um, uh, during the construction, and at the end, it's it's a teamwork that gets the, uh, the job done, and uh, the focus of our entire effort is uh, minimizing uh, inconvenience to the public and improving safety during construction, so that we can complete the process safely and with minimum inconvenience to the public. Thank you again. All right. Hey, thanks, Amjad, for taking a minute and, and talking with our audience. So we're going to be back in 10 minutes with the latest update on what's going on with a workout on CC80 PAVE. So come back in, in 10 minutes. And following that, we will take you out live onto the construction site so you can see how the freeway is looking that you'll be driving on in just a few hours. Thanks for watching.